And because of the attraction and the limit from within ourselves, people of Iman, we have an internal war that is taking place within ourselves. On one side, we have Iman in us. And on the other side, we have the Nafs and Shaitan. These are the two enemies that are fighting within us. And that is why people of Iman, we always feel restless. Restless because our Iman is always fighting the Nafs and Shaitan. Two armies inside. Powerful, huge, gigantic armies. Iman, powerful army. Representative of Allah wa ta'ala. And the Nafs and the Shaitan, they have ganged up against this Iman. Now because Iman is so powerful that Iman is alone for those both of them. And the war field, what they're fighting for, Iman, what is Iman fighting for and what is Nafs and Shaitan correctly fighting for? The war field is the heart of a human being. Iman wants to dominate and conquer. And Nafs and Shaitan collectively formed an alliance, they also want to conquer. And Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa has so beautifully mentioned it. Nowadays, we are more worried about the wars that are taking place in the outside world. Who won the war? Who is defeated? The reality is that we forget the war that is taking place within ourselves and we concentrate on every other war in the outside world. And the reality is that we as Muslims, we are being defeated in the outside world is because we have, our nafs has defeated us inside. And because we are defeated inside, outside we are also going to be defeated. And until and unless we don't conquer our nafs, we will never see victory in the outside world. And this is understood from a hadith that is in Tabrani, where Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is reported to have mentioned, Afzalul jihad, ayyu jahidu nafsa. The greatest jihad, most virtuous jihad, is that a person fights with his nafs. In one hadith, Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has mentioned, the hadith is in Kanzul Ummal, Afzalul jihad, ayyu jahidu rasjuru nafsahu. The most virtuous jihad, not the jihad in the outside world, the most virtuous jihad, and the jihad, the enemy that we really need to conquer, is that Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam mentioned, that the person makes jihad with his own nafs. 